many students would love to have an international experience, but they don't have the time anymore. Our alliance is picking up what is already existing in our society, a high digitalization, a high content of uh, virtual interaction combined with real experience. And I think this is not creating a new room for the student. It is only following which, what is already happening on the level of the new generation. We are recognizing at the moment that many students don't like to go for half a year on an Erasmus program. They would like to do it in a month or so. And if you have these short-term programs, which also is in favor of increasing the number of exchanges per university, then the students would have the advantage of having a, a condensed experience where they are prepared already on the digital level, then they can go in the country, have their experience and go back. So I guess that is a substantial added value for the students. The European Digital University, the short form is EDUC, we use the French, French pronunciation for this, uh, is basically an alliance of six European universities. It is Europe in the first place, then we regard digitalization as a core for the exchange between the universities. And lastly, the S of university is replaced by C to say that universities reflecting society with regard to economical and social backgrounds and diversity. We are developing courses which are hybrid, including digital and face-to-face uh, -face meetings and real mobility on the one hand. On the other hand, we are working on a single sign-on that each student from each university, and we have 160,000 students, it's the size of Potsdam, which are then able to get access to platforms like Moodle and others where they can get digital content, but also digital a remote uh, collaborative online teaching format. We try to bring all levels of our university into this interaction on the European level. We Not only students, not only researchers, but also the staff of the universities are working together and trying to find a way how we can make Europe happen at the academic level. What will be the end of the European Alliance? Will it be that all the six partners will be not any longer existing and be only the European Digital University, not longer the University of Potsdam or the University of Pech or whatever, and we would have a degree which was given by the European Digital University? Why not?